This is Denton County Weather with your latest two-minute forecast. Temperatures out there this morning. It is feeling even chillier than yesterday for most of us across the Metroplex. A lot of DFW sitting in the mid to upper 40s. There are also some upper 30s and lower 40s back off to the west. In the Metroplex, these temperatures I think are being overestimated, but they are probably closer to the lower 50s if you are in the warmest sections of DFW, which would include Plano and Dallas and Fort Worth. Those areas will probably stay the warmest, but um, in Denton County, it's likely right now in the low 40s, so it is definitely feeling chilly out there. It will not feel like that the entire day. We'll eventually see temperatures closer to the low 70s by lunchtime, maybe some upper 60s back off to the west. Eventually by 3 to 4 o'clock this afternoon, a lot of us will at least warm up into the low 70s. I can't rule out maybe still some upper 60s out there, but um, it definitely will still feel like a fairly nice day, and it will still feel dry. So um, no concerns with precipitation here over the next few days, so that's a good sign there. Here's the latest on what we're anticipating for wind gusts today. Obviously, it was very windy Friday. It was windy Saturday. It's not going to be really windy today at all. Um, you can see going throughout the day, most of us will stay light and variable with winds. They will start to start, or they'll start to shift from the coming out of the north to coming out of the south. So just keep that in mind. But again, it's not going to be a dramatic difference. Wind gusts will be the uh, start to go up again closer to Monday uh, across the region, right around 10 to 15 miles per hour. Now, I usually don't show the wind speeds, but uh, some people have been interested in seeing them in the forecast. So I'm going to kind of leave these in the forecast once in a while just so you're aware of what we're anticipating for winds. Um, also going to the dew points, moisture will not be crazy by any means over the next few days, and that does include today. Uh, dew points will stay in the 30s and maybe some low 40s, and that will also include tomorrow. We'll eventually see humidity get closer to the low 50s by Tuesday, but um, rain chances seem very minimal, if any, going into Tuesday and Wednesday. More on that in the seven-day forecast. Quick look at the tropics. There is nothing to look at. We have no chance of any tropical development over the next five days, uh, which is always a great sign, especially since we're October now. We've not seen really any anything in the Atlantic Ocean since September. So obviously we are seeing a very nice ending to the season so far. Obviously storm, you know, tropical depression or storm could still form or even a hurricane during the months of October and November. So we'll still have to watch this closely, but again, it looks pretty low end chances for at least the rest of this month. Here's our latest seven day forecast. So you can see that the temperatures will stay fairly nice, to be honest. Uh, humidity will start to go up again Tuesday and Wednesday, but low end rain chances will be accompanied by that. A cold front will come through. It's not going to be a dramatic cold front, but temperatures will at least drop into the mid seventies for Thursday and Friday, eventually seeing rain chances again returning and humidity returning by next Saturday and Sunday with the chance of maybe an isolated storm or two, but nothing major looks to be in the seven-day forecast at this point, and this forecast is brought to you by All Dense Repair.